all right guys so in the last video we talked about setting up smtp on your domain which we got a congratulatory message but in your case probably you get this error that is showing on the screen right now that uh, the spf is okay but you need to improve deliverability so i'm going to show you how to create the mac record uh, and how to add it to your domain in this video if that sounds interesting make sure you watch to the very end leave a like on the video and subscribe if you are new let's go into the video right now so if you are if you had watched the earlier video on how to set up smtp on your domain then and after that you got this report or you may have it on your site health uh, screen like i have here as one of the recommended improvement so this will enable your uh will prevent your emails from going into spam all right so that is the next thing we want to work on now to do this we need to take some all right so first you need to head over to uh, a website and uh, i'll drop the link to the page in the description of the video so let me go to that page right now so you're going to go to this website and here you need to type in your web address that is your domain name for instance i'm going to type in the one i'm using now so uh let's see I'm using a live uh, I mean a live project this is somebody's website so I don't want to reveal much uh, about the website name so once you type in your domain name you simply click here check the mark record so you check the mark record and uh, since there's no demark record on it let's see the result we get all right so if you look at this place now let me scroll down here so you can see here that uh, there is nothing if you look at this place say suggested record is up, uh, updated as you modify the above you understand so there is no any record found no record found so we need to create a new record from uh, this part of the screen here so all right so the first thing how do you fill these questions here the first one how do you want mail that fill the map to be treated whatever whatever so click on this place and choose quarantine so choose to quarantine it and then come to this place here would you like to have mx toolbox automatically process your dmark report or whatever whatever so this one should be no and as soon as you choose no then this place becomes empty okay so once you do that then come to this place and click show advance show advance and then you scroll down do you want a dmark record policy for subdomain whatever is optional so you just come here and say quarantine then report format that should be afrf is the only option available there okay so then come down to this place reporting interval so you come down here dkim identifier and uh, the record here you just say relaxed and for the last one spf identifier alignment the same thing relaxed so once you've done all of this you scroll back up here and then you can find your record here find the record here 
so what you need to do next now is to log in to your um, cPanel I want to believe you are familiar with cPanel but if you are not I have videos about cPanel tutorial especially the true cPanel control panel I treated that in full details in one of my video uh, I'm going to maybe I'm going to link, link the video as well so that you can watch that if you are not familiar with uh, the screen but there is no need going to watch that video because I'm going to explain how to do this step by step so once you have this record the next thing is for you to uh, log in to your true host account and then go to your cpanel or probably you just type in your domain name forward slash cpanel if you are already familiar with it put in your uh, details and so I'll be switching over to my control panel right now alright so this is the control panel this is the control panel and uh, you need to scroll down on the control panel you need to scroll down to you can take note of all this the edits now that is the subdivisions we need to go to the domain uh, division so on that domain here so on that domain we need to go to zone editor zone editor click on zone editor all right so the list of domain you have there will be listed on the left here so i'm going to uh blow this out because i don't want to reveal information about this uh project so then along the line here you will see all these uh options so along the line of the domain that you want to use just come here and click on manage so once you click on manage you see all the records you have there all you need to do is come to this place and say add record add record so from the information we have there you notice that they told us that the type of record is txt so change that first understand change that first so if you go back to this place you say that the type is a uh, txt then the host name is this okay so host name copy it and then come to this and then this is it put the host name here make sure there is no space at the beginning so cancel the space at the beginning there Alright, so this is the host name. Then TL is 114400. I think it's correct. So you don't need to uh, change that. You just come here and uh, use copy the value. The value that is given here. Everything in front of that value. You copy and then you bring it down here. And then you paste here. And once you've done that, simply click on save record. Save record. Alright, so that is saved. So you have successfully saved the record here. Alright, so that is it. Once you've done that, then... Uh, you should have been able to improve email delivery uh, delivery uh, on this particular website so let me go back and let us see uh, the result of what we've done and uh, let's click here this is where we we had this issue here uh, then let's say send another test mail and uh, I'm going to change this again to my personal email. Okay, it's still loading. OK, 
okay so i want to change this again to uh my personal email and send a test email to it and see what we have although i know that uh, it may not take effect immediately but let's just see so let's say send mail and as you can see here you see that is quite different from what we had the other time so we have a success screen and let's go to the site else i showed you earlier so this issue we had here as one of the recommended uh uh fix let's refresh this page as well so let's say the site else report again okay so if you look at this place critical issue is still there but the recommended improvement where we had that uh, issue is gone so this is how you can uh, improve email deliverability on your uh, website if most especially if you are using uh, true host to host although the second part which is adding the record on your um, I mean adding the record on the C panel is the same thing you do the same thing even creating your DMARC record is the same thing so whether you are using true host or you are using any kind of host and you're having issue with DMARC record or uh, email deliverability probably your email goes to spam uh, by watching the last video on how to set up SMTP and this video on how to add the mark record to your domain you should be able to fix all of that issue and your email should now be delivered to the inbox of anybody across the world thanks for watching i want you to smash the like button on this video and uh, if possible share it on your social media uh, platform so that others could see it and say the great work we are trying to do here and if you are new please subscribe to my channel so that you can always get a uh, uh, update make sure you turn on the notification bell so that you be getting update whenever i drop cool videos like this on uh, wordpress and anything around web design as well as uh, uh, web hosting thanks for watching and i'll see you in another video my name still remain bolaji James. Bye for now.